Yum, yum! William Vaughn here with a quick introduction to Motion Blur and Moto. Motion Blur can be simulated in Moto by enabling the Motion Blur option in the Camera Effects tab for the selected camera. To see the effect in the render preview, make sure Motion Blur is enabled in the Preview Option settings. Once Motion Blur is enabled, Moto takes time samples forward and backward from the rendered frame, blending them together to create the blur effect. There are three attributes for Motion Blur that enable you to adjust the look of the blur to your liking. Blur length controls the length of the motion blur, and the default value of 50% is similar to a real-world camera set with a 180-degree shutter. Shutter speed sets the shutter speed of the camera. The lower the value, the more pronounced the blur effect appears. Blur offset controls the center position and time where Moto samples its motion blur from. Clicking on the small arrow on the right side of each of these fields enables you to choose a preset value as well as save your own. Oh, look at the time. <laughs>